everybody <laughs> welcome back to my channel um, today we are going to do the back of this page and I already put some decoration paper on here I just got back from my nails and they are gorgeous look at this isn't this amazing I really like these flowers so cute 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 okay I will stop anyway <laughs> Um, I will go further on this page. Well, this is the front. Uh, we do that later. So we're going to start at this page. And this page we have these up and down. But first I want to do something on here. And um, yeah, we want this to make it as flat as possible. So I want to do a little pocket on here. And I have this piece left. So I'm going to use it. And yes, I'm still having a cold. So I'm going to fold this down, make a flippity flop, and then make this the good size of your page. And I always like to stay in the lines with my background paper. Okay. And cut this down also with your scissors or with your cutting machine it's all up to you all right so now we have the pocket which way do we like well the flowers pointing out that direction so we are going to point it to that direction okay so you just Now, for this pocket, I think we need something on here. So, what shall we do? Um, mm -mm 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 -mm. So, use this piece. Or, wait, 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 wait. Perhaps this one's also nice. Yeah. I like this one. So, put this away. Let's use this one. I'm going to cut it in the good size. I think this is a bit longer, but... Okay, I'm just going to glue this down. And then I'll come back. Well, perhaps on top is also nice. What do you think? On top of under? No, I think under. I think that's better for the... I think it is. Yeah, I'm going to glue this down and then I'll come back to you and we glue our pocket in and do some background. Yeah, perfect. Back in one second. Okay, I'm letting this dry for just a second, but in the meantime, I can choose my background papers and uh, this is brown, so we can use a lighter one. <clears throat> Let's say, yeah, this one will be perfect for the background. So I'm just going to apply and make it a little lower, of course, and then see that this is the right, correct, the right size of it. Oh my goodness. Okay, let's cut this down. Here we go. Let's smooth this already. Let's see what we are going to make as tags when this is ready. <coughs> you can do that already. Put this away for just a second and I always like to grab my leftover pieces. Let's see if I have any more. Oh, I still have a cheat with these little guys. Also very nice to use. So I'm going to cut these out in a second. <coughs> Let's see which tags. Oh, I still have these also. Let's make a nice tag of this piece. We love it. Um, let's see. 
Now I want to use that big one. Now I think I don't have any other left. So I'm going to use this one. So I'm just going to make a tag. So want to join me for making a tag? Then stay tuned. Okay, so what we have, I already cut these out in um, earlier, white at the beginning, and I don't, I don't know if I'm going to use use it, but now I decided to do, so I'm just going to cut these off. these nice image right here I'm going to line this up so I have a straight line there we go okay yeah I think this is nice now let's see for let's grab another piece and then um, oh, this is also a leftover piece. Let's use that one. This is a leftover piece, and I. Well, I can use this one. Why not? I can. Why not use what I have? Just do it. Just do it. Okay. First of all, I really, 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 really like my pages. So what I'm going to do, um, let's use this ruler. So what I like to do is make a nice edge. Then I'm going to see in which size it needs to be. I'm just going to go all the way around and see where the end is here. Staying straight. See if here we are. Here we go. So this is the base. So I'm just going to glue this down. Now what do we want? Do we want some white on it? And it's really just a little tag. Or a nice little yeah, photo mat or picture you can glue on. Well, this is only the base. I think I want to make a white one on top. So just make the same as we normally are doing. Just a little edge from that paper. Alright, cut it down. There we are. Now don't forget to smooch your edges because I really think that's a very, very nice way to do it. So give it an extra touch. There we go. Here we are. Glue this down. There you go. Just a little extra. Now I do have these little stamps and they are really sweet. Ta -da. Yeah, perfect. What do you think? Yeah, I love it. Just really simple and I love it. Okay, cool. Now, grabbing the other one. 
Let's see what we are going to do with the other one. <coughs> of course, we are going to cut this down. Also, oh, that was really short, Diane. Pay attention that you're not going to cut your nice edge. All right. Um, yep. I really don't like that corner, so I'm just going to, oh yeah, that's way better. Okay, now I'm going to do that again with those pages. I just love that. And you can hate it or you can love it, but I am a page a lot of <laughs> is that an awkward world world yes that is but yeah awkward is my middle name <laughs> I don't know let's line this up again just along the edges I don't know if this is in a straight line I hope it does, but forgive me if it's not. I think it is. All right, glue this down. And I think for this one we're going to need, what do you think? Shall we use design paper? Let's see if I have a nice piece that fits. This is too short. Well, it could be. Let's use this one. So we'll use the lighter one. No, because that is the background. Let's use this, but then with a little bigger, a little bigger um, edge from the page. But it's okay. You can do that. Save your strips. I always like saving the strips. I think in a moment I am really calling the leftover queen <laughs> because I use every single piece. Okay, love this. Yep, cool. All right, so now we have two cards ready to go inside, and you still can write on the back something, but. Let's grab the page back. I think the glue is ready to go now. Oh, yeah, I still can use it. Use it. <laughs> Alrighty, let's see. Let's put this right here. Let's go to this page. Now, first, we are going to apply this piece, I think. And then this one. what we're going to do. Okay, let's glue our pocket in. Don't forget the bottom, otherwise you don't have a pocket. Okay. Stay away from the fold line. the glue do its job because this one does not dry that really quick but it's a good glue all right so now we can apply some glue on the back ground paper I'm going to 
move this really gentle in that pocket. I hope it will fit. Ooh, I think it doesn't. No, wait. We are not going to squeeze it in. No, 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 no. We don't want squeezing those papers. Yes, this fits better. Okay, let's move it on its place. Here we go. That's the pocket. Yeah, cool. I like it. What do you think? Does this need an extra edge? Hmm. I think it does. I'll just really, really, really hope that this... I don't like that cut off little edge. I'm just going to apply a little washi tip. There we go. There we go. Yeah, that does it. That's the finishing touch. I really believe that. That it is. Okay, so now you can tuck in your tags. And that's that. Wow, they are really can go right in. But that's good. Okay, cool. Yeah, you also can use another tag. A larger tag with this one. But this will just fit. But perhaps I'll make a larger tag with it. I don't know, but this could be better when this is a little larger. So, okay, my mistake, but I will make a larger tag with it um, later. Okay, so this is uh, the page, really easy. Now we go to the back of this one. Oh, wait, stay tuned. Okay, so I made a little larger tag um, to put in here. So, yeah, this is better. But I still like to put these in here too. Alright, so. Okay, let's move it on to this piece. <clears throat> um, yeah, I really like that portrait page. So I'm going to make just a portrait um, photo mat in here. And I'm going to... Um, what shall we do with these two? Just photo mats or just a little tuck spot. That's that's nice too. So first of all, I'm going to make that background photo mat, and then I'll come back to you. Okay, let me show you how easy it is to make a nice tuck spot page. Okay, so this is the first thing I did. Just making a nice tuck spot. To put something in here. Oh, I missed. I missed the spot. Okay, there we go. Okay, so what's important? Just use your scraps and glue it on. <clears throat> and you don't have to go all the way down to the bottom of your page because that's a total waste of paper. So put this on here on the top. Then. Find a piece what's fitting here below. I already cut mine. And then glue three sizes. And then you have your tuck spot, your little pocket. Here we go. Now, I really like to give it just a little in in interest. So I'm just going to use this cute little die, which I found in my local store. Called the action. Don't forget the top. And I bought it for 57 cents. 
so that was a good deal and it does cut perfectly when you put a few layers more in your cutting machine so a thin chipboard will do and then run it one two three three times to your big shot or any cutting machine and then it cuts perfectly so yeah that's that let's see which one let me put this in here i didn't don't think that the, the flower is uh, ready to dry yet but oh this one is also nice <clears throat> let's use that one. Oh yeah so that i want this a little shorter that's better all right so that is really easy now these flips up and down so we have our um photo frame photo mat and these little squares right here i think this needs a little oh yeah perfect just add something so it's not boring i don't like boring pages so i could have done this in the corner that you will see but then it's a little surprise when you flip this up okay yeah that's that let's go to the inside the two big pages right here and let's see what we can do right here keep it simple let's keep it simple i was thinking what is wrong with this one but this flips out so i'm just going to pull this out and leave it right here all right so let's see what we can make on this page i think i think a nice photo collage will do it and i'm going to show you how i do that it's really really easy <coughs> to make a nice photo collage okay so stay tuned okay <coughs> what we did is first make a nice frame like we always do then cut a piece of paper in the right size <coughs> let's do that together okay and now the trick is let's do it the scrap queen way and the scrap queen way is fold it in half And I'm going to cut this with a little edge. So let's say cut a millimeter off. Then you have actually cut on each side one millimeter off. So let's do that again on this one. Fold it in half. Same thing. The other piece. Fold it in half. So no measurements needed. Nope. Just cutting off one millimeter off. I like to eyeball it. There we go. That's it. And now you can check if we did it good. And I think we did. Of course we did. Yes. See? Now I'm going to glue these together with you. I'm going to use a glue that will not dry that fast that is the main tip i can give you so let's say this becomes right there and grab the other one and don't push too hard on your first one just gently lay it on its place not pushing it down Maybe you want to wiggle a little. <coughs> okay, the other side. Yeah, don't worry, you can still wiggle. Okay, now we are at that point where I want to wiggle a little. So let's see. This one. Let's 
and you still can wiggle till you are completely satisfied and I think it's a perfect square and then when you are done you can push it down like that easy peasy now what I like to do is well this is nice of course but you can leave it like this or you can search for a nice little thing to put in here I thought I had another butterfly let me search for that butterfly it gives a nice a nice thing or a bigger one whatever you're going to like well bigger ones also nice Ooh. yeah I'm going to use this one I'm just going to what shall I do yeah I'm going to smooch the edges a little otherwise I don't like that simple outside lines I'm going to smooch the way around, all the way around. <coughs> yes. Now I'm only putting one dot in the middle. That's enough. And then put this on the white spot. And then you still can put your photos behind it. Perfect. Yes, I like it. So cool. Alright, see, another page is done. Now to this piece, what shall we do right here? Mm. <clears throat> Don't know yet. We'll see in, in a minute. Okay, stay tuned. Let me think. <clears throat> I really like that um, to use up your scraps all the time. So why not do that with the scraps you have? Now let's see how this turns out so let me see I have this one so this will be very nice photo mats if we put this right here what do you think yes I like that okay so that is the base where I start with This one I like horizontal, and this one I like. I could have done this, but I want it a little playful. <clears throat> okay, let's glue this down. this one right here in this corner okay so that is the base and I'm just going to search which papers I have oh this is the same one so that is not useful well these are pretty small all of them but these two aren't so I'm just using it up and see where it goes well I think I'm just going to use this one right here. Use it. Use it. And you still can use your little scraps, of course. Save it. Okay, glue it down. here in this corner now I see that here is a longer piece oh, that is not fitting that is not nice that is too white well anyway 
we can use another one but let's see where else can we go what else can we go well we can use this one right here my cold is not getting any better for the moment but who knows so you're still hearing me talking a bit through my nose but I'm so silly that's just how it feels right now talking to my nose okay I thought I had oh no that's the same paper Hmm, it could be. Oh, yeah, why not? Let's use this one. Use your scraps. to write a nice little word in or something like that but oop you can anything put anything there <coughs> now what we can do is I really need something for that piece let's see for this to fill up Mm, 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 mm. I don't want to waste too much paper. Oh yeah, this is perfect. Well, let's use this one. So yeah, I'm just going to cut it down. All shapes I like. see what we can do for the top the left top okay let's fill this up first here we go yep now what we can do on here is to make another funky thing with um, strips I always like that. You know I like that. <laughs> but I don't know if I have enough. So let me first check it out. If I have enough. Because I don't want to waste any paper. I hate wasting paper. So I'm just going to check it out. What I have. Well, I think I get pretty far. perhaps one piece right here oh and a last piece well I can make it so yeah shall we do this together do you want to see me doing this <laughs> I don't know well just stay tuned if you like and if you don't like then just leave me <laughs> I'm so sorry it's just I really like using all my scraps and some of you really like to see me doing it so I'm just keep filming okay now I really want this piece I'm just going to lay it down and see how much of this one needs to be a very very small piece and give it a little hand Yep, there we go. <coughs> okay, so I'm just going to search <coughs> which papers 
<coughs> oh my gosh, I really need a drink. Mm -mm -mm -mm. Otherwise I keep parking. Really, stop it. Well, gives the idea that <coughs> when it's there, <coughs> it won't go easily out. Won't it? Nope, it isn't. Oh, now I feel that it's almost gone. Oh my gosh, what I'm telling you guys. I'm telling you that my... <laughs> oh my god. I am so crazy. I am so sorry. <laughs> oh, this one is also a neat little hand. Of tearing down. Oops. So what are you guys up to today? Well today here you know, it's Thursday. So I don't know what you all up to. It's short one. But see what is the planning for the couple of days well tomorrow it's friday and tomorrow i need to go with my girl to the physio again um let's see and then when i came back when i put her off to school perhaps well i don't know I hope I can film a few hours tomorrow, but sometimes it's not always possible with all the housekeeping stuff and anything. This has a little ink on it. I don't mind having that little ink on it. I really don't. That's the risk of being paper. <laughs> anyway, in about a few weeks, well, is it two or three? I don't know exactly, but in a few weeks, the end of this month, I go on holiday again. Ooh, well, not again. Well, yeah. <laughs> yes, girl, it is again. And Let me see. And that means that I can not craft for a complete week. Ah! <laughs> so yeah, sometimes it's really handy that I do um, make videos longer so I can provide you videos on Monday, Wednesday, Friday. So that is really handy so sometimes i will upload an extra video on a sunday or saturday but i will not do that too often otherwise i don't have something when i am ill or when i going on a little vacation or something like that so diane you should not do that too often <laughs> okay so what do you think about my little scrap page? I like it. So you still can add two nice pictures right here. I really like that. I can make it a little more interest. Why not? Give it a little more interest using a little die. Let's cut this in half.
hair or hair or work. Hmm. This one is also nice. What do you think? So you still can add your picture behind this. Hmm. I think I like it. Or up here. What do you guys, what do you think? No, nope. I made up my mind. I made up my mind. So I'm just going to glue this down. And I don't want this corner. So I'm just going to apply till here. So this I will leave it open. So if you have a photo, you still can tuck this behind here. That's perfect. Now add something. I want something. We start first, we start first with this leaf. Then this flower. And then this butterfly. And as you can see, I only glue on the right side. So you know what that means, that means that we still can place something, your photo right here, that, that does it mean. <laughs> yeah, I like it, really simple actually, but tuck spot here, yeah, I really like it, how this turns out, I hope you do too. <coughs> Sorry, 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 sorry. Hmm. I am. Um, this is not working with the rest of the paper, so don't do it. Okay. <laughs> All right. How do you think? Oh, yeah, I really like it. So let me grab stuff for the front page. Cool. I really like how this turns out. So if this is all down, then you get this piece right here and then we get this pocket right here with something in it and then we have this one and we have these little tuck spots with photo mats lots and lots of place cool I really like how this turns out so cool all right so yeah time for the top page <laughs> oh my god <coughs> watching let's see what we are going to do right on this page I have something in mind so stay tuned okay let's see what we have right now well the base of course cutting your black sheet your whoa, this is brown <laughs> cutting your brown craft sheet as a base then use your scraps first always if you like, if you want to cut a new piece, that's also possible, of course. Well, I also put my marks in here and the uh, little magnets are in between these two papers. So I am set to go. And what do I want for this one? Well, I definitely want some embellishments right under here. So I stay away because I put some uh, pencil marks right here for that closure. Um, so what can we do? Um, I think I want a page that goes to the left. And, and underneath perhaps we can make a nice photo frame 
that goes to the white. And then we still have here a little left for a nice decoration. What do you think? Hmm. Yeah. So first I'm going to make my mark right here on this spot. Now I really hope that I'm not going to make any mistakes this time. Do you remember the first mistake? Oh, not first. Oh my gosh, no, not the first mistake, but <laughs> that cutting mistake we did yesterday. Well, at least I did yesterday. I hope you did not, but if you are a currently follower, <coughs> then perhaps <laughs> you did exactly the same as I did. I don't blame you if you don't want to see first all the episodes and then start. I can imagine that you just start with me in the trust that I give you <laughs> right away the good information. Well, that I cannot promise you guys. <laughs> okay, so let's flip this over. down tape here it is okay that's one now let's see where are the other ones I don't want this right away in the middle what do you think well it could be it could why not then I have a little more space for embellishments Yeah, let's do that. Okay, so the distance I have here, I want here too. So I'm just going to eyeball this a bit. Right here, open this up. Now make a mark here and here. Now keep focus, keep focus, keep focus where your mark is. That's right here. And here, do I am still good? Yes, I am still good. Yep, here we go. Alrighty. <clears throat> Let's cut this. I hope the light is still good because I already put my hot glue on. And then that means that I need to turn off one light I have so many electrical <laughs> lamps on that I can't have enough of that electrical cases I call these where you put your power in Let's secure it with some tape and then we are good to go and see what embellishments we are going to use. Okay, yeah, this I like. So we have one, two flip open and you still can put a photo in here. Yeah, that is what I like. Now for the closure for this page to keep it all together, I was thinking about a swing tab and how why not use a chipboard piece it's always nice to use um, so what do you think where do we want this do we want this right here at the bottom so that means that this needs to go higher Let's say right here That's a possibility. Oh, I think I will like that. Yes, I like that. So that is the first thing I do. Now this one is really short. Grabbing. Where are the large, the larger? Oh 
Oh yeah, I already put them in the box. Oh yeah, totally forgot that. That I already put that in a nice box. Okay, so this one is really larger than these small ones. Really happy to have these. Okay, let's move along. Here we go. Cool. Oh, this will embellish, so it needs to go up. And then it's a nice touch, a nice closure. Cool. Alrighty, well, uh, next step is off camera, putting some on these photo mats and then see what kind of embellishments I like right here. And then I'll come back to you to finish it all up. Okay, stay tuned. Alright, I have again a bunch of things and first of all I want to show you what the base is and the base is um, we created this sewing tab and I put some book page underneath then I cut out these strips glue them on then cut out this craft brown paper I glued some leaf on here but not glued it all down so you can still put your photo on and then we go to the left and I kept this blank so you can still put your photos on then again <coughs> I use some book page for the all the way around I use this paper oh my gosh and my new nails are all already glued then I use just a little tab on the bottom for just to give it an extra touch and then here it's plain too and you still can have lots of things um, a nice photo in here too okay so that is the base now we still have a, a little spot here not too much because here is the closure right here so this you have to think of right here that's the closure so we have just a little spot here but we have a spot so First of all, I thought, well, perhaps it's nice to put a nice big flower right here, but oh, it's too big, so I don't want that. So next thing, I'm just going to add and see what how it goes. So first thing I did is put a half doily right here, and I'm going to flat this one. I think I want this right here. So I'm just going to add something and see how it goes. I don't know. Go with the flow. These are actually from 94 Market. I'm going to use these right here. Flatten these out. I don't want to tear these away. Glue this down. They're now all yep, they all set. Now let's see. Do I have this one? I don't think that this is too too um I call that too oh my gosh, this is also a nice one. Hmm. this is flat if you are going to push this down this oh yeah definitely definitely going to use this right here not too far because our cover up is right there and you still can add if you like and I like that you know that I like that you still can add a little little piece in the middle Let's see how that turns out don't fall down don't fall down oh my gosh I love that it gives it just an extra touch yeah cool Yep, like that. Alright, so 
<clears throat> from here on you can go further say I really like this but I want to be as flat as possible so again I'm going just going to ruin my flowers no it's not ruining but you can imagine that it that is actually not the plan but you see that white thing in here I don't like it's too bulky for my page here it goes so now we have a nice excuse to put something in there well shall we this is also a nice one hmm no not for this one also can add just a little tiny Ooh. Hmm. Could be. It's a possibility. Where is my brown piece? Oh gosh, I really have too much too much going on. Where is it? Oh here it is. Oh my gosh. I want a dark brown. I believe I want that. I don't know for sure, but just going to see how that turns out. Just going to see how that turns out. Yep, I like that. No, 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 there we go. Whew. Oh yeah. Keeps falling down my other ruler. <laughs> okay. There we go. Keep pushing. Oh yeah. Here we go. <clears throat> okay. Now squeeze these a little back here to give these another nice yeah I like that this is so cool see we just make our own customized flower <laughs> yes we did now let's see what else what else I do have this one. I really, really like to use this one somewhere. Now, see if it is, does not go in the way. And it doesn't. So, I'm just going to apply this one right here. It does not go in the way. Nope, it isn't. Okay. Then, I think this one fits perfectly right here. So we can, I don't know, sometimes people do, how you call that, that little around, I don't know, but how that, how they do that, let me try it out, oh my gosh, that I'm even going to try this out on camera, it says a lot, <laughs> I don't know, how do they do that, just like this? Oh, I'm not trying to rip off my flowers, and they are. <laughs> okay. Hmm, okay. And then, just... What do you think? I don't know. Is this something to use? What do you think? I really don't know. Perhaps something on the front of a cover, but perhaps. I don't know if I like it. No, I don't like that. Let me use this one. That's better. That's way better. <coughs> it's all muddy. Gone. My glue. 
And this trick, someone told me, I forgot the name, but someone gave me that trick. Really love that trick. Um, yeah, we need to fill up this gap. I think. You take this little one right there. And then I think this brown one fits right there. Keep it as flat as possible. I am. I do my best. I do my best. do my best. Now I really have these small itchy pitchy tiny pieces. I want to fill up this little gap with those little pieces. These are really tiny. So cute. One here. Just to fill up. Alright, it is getting somewhere. It gives a little contrast. Yeah, I like that. What do you think guys? Is it going somewhere? I like it. Just a few. Tuck it in. Let's see. Oh, this is a white. <coughs> okay. Mm -mm -mm -mm. We are getting somewhere. We want this to come back. I don't want to be too close to that, to this fold line. Otherwise. There we go. Just tuck this in. There we go. Just a little extra touch. Just a little extra touch. Give it a touch. We need that. See if this fitting. Somewhere here below. Just trying it out. Tink. Yep. See? It's fitting. Yeah, 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 yeah. And we use it all. Oh my gosh, yes, I'm going to use it all. I so like this one. I did uh, tell you that. If I will see this color again, I will buy it. Yes, I do. So much I love this one. Cool. Now this one is really screaming at me. Please take me. I don't know. Does this color fit anywhere? I don't know. I don't think so. It's too bright. What do you think? I don't like it. I don't like it. I want some <coughs> a little one. Let's see if those 40 my markets. Yes, it does. Let's grab two. This one is too big. Oh my gosh, these lace, these leaves are also so nice. I want one too. Okay, let's close it up. Let's see if I can squeeze these somewhere. I really like this leaf. Let's see, that fits. I 
really like this because it's the same color as this, the, the other one. Let's squeeze it right there. Perfect. Perfect, perfect. A bit over that little frame. And then I think I have to stop. Oh, just one more on the bottom. Hell yeah, why not? Just one here. Yes, that's that. And now I will stop. I will. <laughs> we have already enough. Now, move it up. Move it, move it, move it all up. Give my page some space. Give it some space. Okay. Yeah, we have to do that in just a second. I think I'm going to pull out my hot glue. Here it goes before it lays on the floor. <coughs> okay, let's erase my marks. this in our page and then we have created another space another space <laughs> another page oh my god okay and when this is finished we have three pages and then I decide I think it's enough because we have to make the cover and we have to make the inside pages cover of the inside pages of the cover. So I think I think three is enough. But I will show you in a minute how that turns out. Okay. Ta -ta -dum, ta -ta -da -da -ta -ta -dum. Let's put this on its place, and that's why I use that glue that is not that quick of a dryer, so I can squeeze and wiggle if it's needed. Okay, I'm making this open, so I can push in here. <coughs> Especially here on the edges with that clear sheet. We don't want this to come loose. Okay, I think we got it. Ta -da. Ta -da, ta -da. Yeah, this is really fluffy, but it's still flat when this is done. So cool. Okay. Oh yeah, I removed that one. The closure. That is why it's getting loose. Let's put this back in. And we still can decorate these big tags. But perhaps it's better to keep this only with the brown. So... People can put a nice big photo on it. Oh my gosh, I really like it. Yes, perfect. Okay, so how thick are our pages? Well, that's one, two, three pages. So, how thick is this? Well, I think it's thick enough. Because we need to make two inside pages already. So how thick is this? In inches it's a small two and a half <coughs> and in centimeters that will be well, six or six and a half. We'll say it's six. 
Yeah, it's a six. So a six centimeter. That's, and when you are using your cover, you need to make um, the inside pages too. Well, I believe that you can make them plain, but I like to do some um, activity on the inside of the cover too. So I will stop at three pages. I think we have made quite nice thick pages. What do you think? I absolutely love it. So yeah, I will stop and then um, yeah, I think the next time we'll meet again is making the cover. Oh, I, I truly am in love with this one. Such natural colors and everyone will love it, I think. Some wedding albums are just pink or gold with white, black and white. But these are really natural colors. I think a person who is a really na a nature uh, person adores this. I, I, I really believe that. I really love it. If I were marry, <laughs> but I'm not, but I really like these colors. Oh, wait! <clears throat> Enough brabbling about myself, about not marrying. <laughs> um, yeah, I hope you liked this today. And, uh, well, Diane, just stop filming because those guys really don't want you to see or hear you brabbling about your cleaning up your desk. They don't. Just stop the camera, please. I will. Oh my god, it's such a mess here. I hate it. I really hate it. I really hate it. I hope this this album is pretty <laughs> so ready because I really hate those mess. Oh my god. Okay, I will stop rambling. Um, yeah, see you tonight or tomorrow. We'll see. We'll see what happens. All right. Bye bye. Thanks for watching and thanks for joining me. Till next time. Thank mm -hmm. you.